straight from the box, the DAC Magic XS is an instant upgrade to any computer's sound output. But there are a couple of different ways that you can use the DAC Magic XS, meaning that you'll always get the best possible sound, whatever you're listening to. There are two different USB audio classes, class one and class two. As standard, Windows only supports class one. Using the DAC Magic XS in its default class one mode will give you a huge improvement in sound compared to the computer's own headphone output. However, there are a couple of even bigger improvements that can be gained by using your DAC Magic XS in class two mode with your Windows computer. The first, most important improvement is better sound quality. Using class two results in much less distortion or jitter being sent to the DAC Magic XS than in class one mode. This gives you a much bigger improvement in sound quality for all of your music, including Spotify, YouTube videos, or lossless music files. Class one also only allows you to play a maximum of 24 bit 96 kilohertz files. So the second improvement of using class two is that you can play up to 24-bit 192 kilohertz audio files through the DAC Magic XS. Here, I'm going to show you which settings you need to get the best sound from your computer. You'll only need to do this once, as your computer will remember the settings next time you connect your DAC Magic XS. First, connect your DAC Magic XS and switch it into Class 2 mode by pressing and holding both volume buttons on the DAC Magic XS for five or six seconds until the LED flashes pink three times. This means that the DAC Magic XS is now in class two mode. Because Windows doesn't natively support class two, you'll now need to install the free Cambridge Audio USB class two driver available from our website, following the simple instructions that are also provided. Once the driver is installed, go to your computer's sound menu and select CA DAC Magic XS 2.0 as the default speaker output. You'll also need to go into the speaker properties menu and adjust the output depending on what you want to listen to. For Spotify, YouTube, MP3s or CDs, we'd recommend that you set this at CD quality. If you want to listen to higher resolution studio master quality files, then you can increase this setting up to 2496 or 24192. There are many media players, such as FUBAR 2000, which will adjust this setting automatically for you. To see how to use these, have a look at the setup guides on our website. If you want to switch back to class one mode, then you can repeat the process. Press and hold both volume buttons for five seconds again, but this time the LED will flash blue three times to indicate that it's back in its default class one mode, which is ideal if you're using the DACmatic XS with multiple computers. You can switch between class one and class two mode as much as you want, but we would always recommend using class two wherever possible because of the better sound quality that it offers.